Yeah, I mean, I it was a script that was developed by uh, by Teresa Park already, and I would I've never actually not started the process myself. I'm always the one to first option the material and develop that script. So it really spoke to the caliber of the script that when they came to me, uh, I was it felt like a project that I might have started from scratch. Um, when Luca came on and Luca wanted Timmy to do it, and Luca and Timmy said, you know, we're getting the band back together, come do the movie with us, and I said, sure, let's go do it. But I think it, it was, yes, the subject matter at first glance looks to be crazy and out there, but I think you can see a lot of, in that movie of the through lines to the sorts of stories I'm drawn to, and the kinds of, again, folks living uh, in, you know, uh, in the margins and finding ways uh, to put a light on those stories uh, and, and show in that what is still sort of universal, whether it's you know, a young Jewish boy in 1980s in Call Me By Your Name, or, uh, you know, Frances McDormand in Nomadland, her character, or, you know, the cannibals in, in, in Call Me By Your, uh, in Bones and All, I think there's a commonality to all those stories at their key. Thanks for watching the You Interview channel. With over 3,000 original celebrity videos, we have one of the largest collections of celebrity interviews anywhere. So remember to like and comment on our videos and subscribe to the channel. If you want to get more involved, you can become a member of the channel. Membership has its perks. You can see exclusive celebrity videos and get the opportunity to ask our celebrity guests questions. We can't wait to hear from you.